from Technology got us here, and I'm at the ThemeZoom Protege event in Chicago with David Bullock. And David, I am so excited about the blueprint that you created for Barack Obama's social media campaign, and I would love for you to share a little bit about that with my users. Well, we actually started tracking Barack Obama about 18 months ago to see how he was using social media differently than anyone else. And as you know, it's been probably the most successful initiative to date using user-generated content, all the social media outlets for two-way communication in the marketplace. Twitter, he's well over 110,000 people, I believe, now on Twitter. He has more user-generated content on YouTube than anyone else. And we've actually been able to look to see what he did and actually how he did it, um, interviewing the website designers and the people who are actually implementing the, uh, the actual strategy and tactics. It's available over at Barack 2.0, which is a play on Barack Obama uh, Web 2.0. So Barack 2.0. Dot com is where it all is, and it's um, since August the 1st until now, it's a, it's a weekly or bi-weekly podcast on what he's doing now and how he's doing it, and it's become very informative. It's gotten picked up by major magazines, um, it's been written up in the newspaper, so it's actually, the blueprint itself is actually gaining its own news and creating more user-generated content. So he had all user-generated content, which meant that all of the articles that were going out on his social media campaign were 100% unique content. Mm -hmm. That's quality content. Yeah. And so the search engines were giving him ranking basically just out the roof because every article that was submitted had unique content with relevant keywords. And as far as search engine optimization goes with social media, you have the ability to put unique content out there using your unique keyword theme. And he picked up on that. And obviously it worked. I mean, up to this point, he's broken all sales records, well not sales records, but donation records. He was able to produce $150 million of the donations with an average donation of only $100. So that means that he actually met the people where they were, was able to make a good call to action, was able to actually sell the idea into the marketplace unlike any other. So it's been a fascinating study over the last 18 months. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to read more about your study. So all of you, head on over to his website on the Barack Obama social media campaign, which was? Barack20. So it's Barack20, Barack20.com. Okay, and I've been sitting here with David Bullock. Thank you so much, you guys. Thank you, David. Thank you.